Yes, well, that's because it melted. Something anyone would know who's not hideously inbred. Warren? Yep, yep, sorry, sorry, I forgot my glasses. Maggie, you can tell your lawyer to stick it in his briefcase, all right? I am not signing the divorce papers until I get the porcelain thimble collection. I don't care whose great-grandmother smuggled them out of Poland or how. That is what I want. No, uh, Tony, I will be in a play. You understand? Performing. Uh, I'm not opposed to eat the Legos. Oh, God, it's like talking to Keanu Reeves. Hey, my maid's a puppet. You know, she's terrible, but she's illegal, so I can pay her dirt. Yes, well, clearly oh. this is where I make my contribution. Get the pack open. Let's see, oh. we got some Vicodan, Percodan, oh, Percocet, uh, Greenies, oh. Yellow Jacket, oh. and uh, this here red one. Oh, what's the red one do, oh. Black? Uh, let's find out. He is mandating that I go on a diet. Mm. Okay, I'm thrice divorced, Gil. I've shed enough ugly fat for one lifetime. You're a kid. It actually says that? Oh. Maury, you are the worst agent. Why would you allow a clause in my contract that forces me to lose weight? I am not fat! I... Don't be ridiculous! Of course I can touch my toes. Here, I will prove it to you. Uh, I'm something ripped. No, I'm not wearing pants. I... Maury, uh, I think I just taught myself a new one. People, I am not fat. I am voluptuously muscular. I, for one, welcome my brother from the stage. It will be nice to finally have a true actor to help me carry the show's full dramatic weight. Warren, here's your banana for the punky the chunky monkey sketch. Try not to eat it this time. Well, that was unfortunate timing. No, it is not end of discussion, Gil. I do not want to sing this song with Daddy. I do not want to sing this song with Bla. I want to sing this song all by myself. You hear me? Me, me, me. Uh, <clears throat> you summoned me? Yes, Warren. Uh, we're having a little casting session in here. We're uh, thinking of making a small cast change. You spotty bastard! I give you the best years of my life, and this is how you repay me? Well, the joke's on you, you godless bloodsucker. I am an actor. Mm hmm yes, I have range. And I don't need your insipid little moppet show. I just want you to read with the other actors, Warren. We're replacing Rochester. Oh. Well, apparently you do read the suggestion box. Hey, what's everybody standing around for? What, did Roger dance himself to death? <laughs> He's dead. Oh, great. Now I'm the jerk. Oh, elliptical. Well, my, my, they must be using some awfully big words on the Cartoon Network. Oh, good God, this isn't gonna be like the time you threw me a party and then cleaned out my liquor cabinet, is it? That wasn't a party, that was an intervention. No, Darty. He was a pathetic mm -hmm. hack. Mm -hmm. Well, it, it's hard coming into a new place when he's surrounded by such talented actors. <laughs> most of these people suck. They only look good in comparison to him. I mean it, you know, most of you? You really do suck. Pizza man. Safety is at stake. Careers are on the line. This situation demands realism. <clears throat> Service. I didn't order. Die, you I, sir, am an actor first, a puppet second, and an ape third. I am not a dog, but if I were, I would bite you thusly. Oh, 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 oh. oh, I know what this is about, and it is utterly ridiculous. I am not an anorexic. Oh. Please, I played the unscrupulous owner of a nursing home in a very well-received episode of Diagnosis Murder, and I think I know a prop when I see one. Ah, oh! oh! oh, come on, Rachi, let the kid go. He's not worth it. Just face facts, man. All right, you're not the performer that you used to be. Yeah, that's not what your ex-wife said. <laughs> All right, give me the freaking... Come on, come on, come on, come on! God, you crazy bastard! You want a piece of me, furball? What did you call me? Let's go! Die for me, Jacket! Die for me, Jacket! Oh, I've put on a false face long enough. The worst thing that a father can say is, Monkey boy, monkey boy, stupid, stupid monkey boy! <laughs> How you doing? 
Hey, Warren, actually, I'm not doing yeah, too good. Yeah, good, because I need you to run me a little errand. I want you to scoot over to my house, all right? Uh, in the backyard, you're going to find a pile of dog crap. Now, when you get there... You want I... me to clean up dog crap off your lawn? No, no, of course not. I want you to take it to the veterinarian to be analyzed. I want to see if it's from Corey Feldman's dog. They can test for that? No, the former child star is my neighbor. And in addition to making second-rate movies and getting in trouble with the law, I suspect he's been having his dog mess up my lawn. So I fed the mutt some raspberries. And if I can find traces of it in his gift, I shall put them in a paper bag, light it on fire, and shove it down Corey Feldman's throat. Yeah, you sure about that, Tubbo? Because we're actually having a special on Shut Your Fat Face. You know, I pretended I was, and, uh, well, of course you all believe me. I mean, how could you not with my acting skills? You play a professor. Not a good one. I'm drunk half the time. Why are you siding with him? I want a mini-fridge in my dressing room. You can have the small square one, but not the taller rectangular one. Done and done. You're on your own, kid. <clears throat> you know, Gary, I, I would like to talk to you about, uh, you know, some uh, clunky writing there in the second act. It, it, but it's Shakespeare. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, all right, I'll make it work. <clears throat> I look fat. P-H-A-T, fat. 